day two on the Starbanger Fjord and today we're arriving in Hürzals in Denmark in early morning and you can see our route today here on the map and we are starting very early in the morning because I woke up very early to make the ship tour that you already saw and here we can enjoy one more time the beautiful view from the sun deck and the beautiful sunrise that was just starting with this amazing orange sky that was very nice i really enjoy these early mornings once you're awake it's very nice to be on a ship early in the morning enjoying the sunrise and seeing how the ship is slowly waking so that was very nice but then it was time for the breakfast and this time i was a typical german and waited in line till the restaurant opened And here you can see the buffet which was comprehensive and nicely stocked with a good choice and also very good quality and the restaurant itself is also looking very nice and as I was one of the first to enter the restaurant I got this amazing table right at the window with a perfect view over the stern wave and here you can see it does not look like this typical ferry buffet restaurant which on many ships just looks like a canteen here it really looks like on a cruise ship and it was a very nice breakfast with this amazing view in a nice restaurant so i really enjoyed that and soon after the breakfast hilsals was inside First you can see the lighthouse and then the city gets also closer. So it is the perfect time for a small conclusion. Of course there are a few downsides of this ferry like the lack of lounge area when the ship is fully booked. But this is just a small negative thing and in general I really enjoyed staying on this ferry. It's a very nice ship with very good food. So I can highly recommend taking the ferry, the Starwanger Fjord or its sister ship Bergens Fjord. And one thing that came to my mind when I was on the ship is that this is the perfect extension to a Hurtigruten cruise. If you're taking the Coastal Express from Bergen, please consider to travel to Bergen with this ferry because it feels like you get an extra day of Hurtigruten because you're taking this scenic route it just feels like a coastal express, especially the part from Starwanger to Bergen. So in my opinion, it is a perfect extension for a cruise with Hurtigruten. So if you're traveling to or from Bergen, I would highly recommend taking the Fjordline ferry to travel to or travel home from Bergen. And then it was time to say goodbye to the beautiful Starwanger Fjord and leaving the ship in Hilzhals. And the terminal itself is modern, but unfortunately the port of Hilzhals at the part where the fjord line is docking is not very modern because if you are traveling without a car, you need to walk on the street. There is no pavement at all, so this was quite Disappointing for such a big ferry port like Hirtshals with many ferry routes to Norway and even to Iceland and still there was no pavement on the way from the terminal to the station which is a walk of around 20 minutes. Well, I was walking to the Skaga Hotel and there we will continue in the next video. That's it for this video. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. Here you can see when my next video will be uploaded and the name of the song. And as always, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please consider to like, subscribe, comment or share the video link. And I hope to see you in the next video.